Today at Ham Radio QRP, we take a look at using a home-built side tone oscillator for practicing your Morse code with straight keys and mechanical keys. A couple videos ago, I demonstrated the Heathkit Electronic Design Experimenter, and I showed it with a um, breadboarded circuit that I was building for a side tone oscillator. Basically, it's a simple multi-vibrator circuit that uh, I've added a RC filter to to smooth out its side tone. So why would I want to build a side tone oscillator? Why would I want to build an oscillator for a Morse code key? For many years, I've had this MFJ 557 practice key. And it was the first key I bought, and I bought it to practice Morse code back when I wanted to get my general. And it has a horrible sound. You hear how it sort of squeaks. Um, it's using a 555 timer. Um, there's no smoothing of the signal. So by having this circuit with um, the RC filter, I get a nice side tone. Isn't that a pleasant? That's just a nice, pleasant side tone. It was all John Grower parts, so I didn't purchase anything. But, uh, far more pleasant to listen to, so here you go. See, much more pleasant than... This one even has, of course, a blue light. So um, if you want to practice sand sound, you can practice your visual learning. Um, it's hooked up to an old Archer external speaker. It also has just enough output to drive some earbuds, so I don't have to use an external speaker if I don't want to. There's a 9-volt battery in here powering it. The 9-volt battery is basically in series with the uh, Morse code key, so... Unless the key is closing the circuit, there's absolutely no current draw, so the battery can just stay in there. There's no need for an on-off switch. The key is the on-off switch. Um, by the way, this is my, my Junker, um, old German key with its uh, hood off right now. But anyway, make yourself a Morse code oscillator for your straight key. You'll thank yourself uh, when you're just wanting to practice and hear a nice smooth side tone. Of course, it's also good to use your practice oscillator with your Vibraplex bug.